Today is July the 2nd, uh, 2016. I just received my package, my Pine 64 that I had uh, gotten from the uh, Kickstart project several months ago. But anyway, finally received it today and I'll just show you some what came in the package. Okay, first off, uh, it's come with a micro. I ordered a little micro SD card, which was an 8 gig I ordered, which would include the Android 5.1. Uh, what they did, they said it, they put a little notation that says um, since the price difference between 8 and 16 was that much different, they just gave me a 16 gigabit, which is nice of them. So, and here is the power supply, which is a 5 volt, 2 amp power supply. This is for the uh, batteries, where you can actually have a battery on the board itself. HDMI cables. I'm assuming this is the board itself right there. And that box, I'm assuming, is the remote. And this particular one, uh, I'm not sure what's in that box. I haven't opened it yet. But there, that package, is the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth module. So... I will be opening these other boxes and see what's in them, but one of them should be the board and one of them should be a, uh, the enclosure for it. So anyway, I will open it up and crank it up and put it on the TV and see what it looks like. Just be patient and it will be there. Okay, I went ahead and opened up the two little boxes that uh, had the parts in. The bigger box was actually the enclosure which is a sandwich type with the uh, uh, looks like plexiglass enclosure and here is the uh, board itself and there's a remote that came with the package and it has a sensor there which I have to figure out where to put it but anyway that's the board and I want to show you a comparison of the uh, re a remote control now this one actually come with my ADT2 or ADT1 but anyway, that's a remote control, and that should give you a reference of what the size of the board is. Now, in order to assemble this board, I gathered up all the tools that I assume will be necessary to put it together. So, uh, now my next step is to start assembling it. So, here's all my tools I will be using to assemble it. So, stay tuned, and if I get it working, I'll show you a display on the TV. Thank you.